All right, so I get a lot of um, people, I see a lot of people asking how to um, tur turn on casting mode or how to cast games, or I guess uh, how to spectate, how to turn on spectator mode for contractors, and um, this video is going to be how, how we get that turned on. So um, first off, what you got to do is you have to download or you have to have a strong enough computer and you have to own the game. So after you buy the game and you do have a computer that can run most games, or I'd say some games at least, uh, you, it doesn't need to be extremely strong, but it has to be strong enough so that way it can, because uh, you're just spectating, it's not going to run as hard as if you were going to play on VR. But um, you need to own contractors, so you have to buy it, and then uh, wherever you buy it, it doesn't matter, I don't think, as long as you can get it onto your computer. So, um, like I personally, I own it on Oculus, and so after you buy it on Oculus, if you say you have it on, Ocu like if you have it on your headset, uh, that's all you need. You don't, you don't have to buy it again. You just go to the Oculus app on your computer, and uh, you hit. You just look up Oculus app, and then you go to installing Oculus app, and then uh, if you, <laughs> it'll take you to this, or it'll take you to this, and you just scroll down and you click right here. You know, Oculus setup dot exe. And um, right there, and you download it, download it, go through everything. It's not hard, it's not complicated. Go ahead and download it if you're concerned about anything or <laughs> need problems with it, let me know. Um, so anyway, after you download it, you just uh, you look up the game go contractors and uh, you install it. And uh, that, that's all you really need to do for that. Go to your library and um, details. That'll tell you where you saved it to. And that'll be useful in a second. So after you have the game downloaded, you have to have Steam on your computer, which is the only way I personally know how to do it is by going through Steam. Um, so download Steam. It's a video game software. It's so you can download different video games and play them or whatever else it's like the epic games launcher or anything else uh just the same thing you just pop up google you look up uh steam download it'll take you to uh store.steampower.com and you just go up here you install steam login so you just install it and you log into steam make your account whatever it's not that hard either. And then after you install Steam, uh, your library will not be filled with games. It'll be pretty um, empty, but I play on my computer quite a bit. So after you install Steam, you want to, and you install Contractors. After that, add a game, and then add a non-Steam game. And uh, you can see everything you have. You hit Browse, and... Uh, you go to where your game is. So for me, it's under my Easy Store, which is an external hard drive, and under under my uh, gamer folder, software folder, Caveman Productions. And if you can't find it, um, like I was saying earlier, you go to your contractors in your library on Oculus app or wherever you downloaded it, and you hit those three lines. You hit details, and you hit this right here you see your location you see uh e wherever wherever you put it it might be a d it might be a um a different letter here that doesn't matter you just click on that it'll copy it and then uh, you can just click right here at the top of this folder and uh, you can control v and it'll put in exactly where it is you just hit enter or uh it'll give you two options um you just hit enter and it'll it'll take you to it. And 
you just want to click on that and you want to hit open. I already have it, so I'm not going to hit open, but you hit open. And then you should have a game under uncategorized, uncategorized or installed locally. Uh, I put it in my own folder. And then you'll have the game. And that that's for if it's if you didn't download it on Steam. So if you already have it on Steam, then all you have to do is you have to go to the game and you'll have it right here. And after you have it, it'll look something like this. It'll have the Unreal Engine logo and it'll be pretty blank. And then you just hit the settings cog wheel, the manage button, settings, whatever. You go to properties and then you copy this, you copy paste this code right here. You do dash n n o h m d space, and then you put a space, and then you do dash capital S spectator capital M mode, and uh, no spaces there except for in between the no h m d. Um, and you hit equal one. You can see it right there. I don't know if it's big enough. I'll make it bigger for you. Okay, never mind. I won't. Here, I'll just put it. You just type that in under launch op options. You just type that in under launch options. You'll have it right there. Just control C, control V. And uh, then you're basically done. It should, it should be ready to run. And you just hit play. After you hit play, it'll take a second and it'll load into your game. And then uh, after I load in, I'm going to show you guys the controls, and then that'll be it. So if you guys need any questions, any concerns, anything, uh, if you have anything that you don't understand, if you catch me streaming, I'll probably respond to you in the chat, uh, or over at uh, twitch.com, or it's twitch.tv forward slash lord, uh, would you blow me, don't worry about spelling it, and then, um, sorry about that, um, Um, after that, um, <laughs> or you can ask me questions on my Discord, which is V-E-R-U-M, and then you, uh, for the numbers, it's hashtag 4745, or the pound, whatever, uh, 4745, you just, um, add me on Discord, and, or message me on Discord, you'll see me active on the contractor's Discord, whatever else, and, um, Easy peasy. So after you um, find a game, you can run around, mess around with all the controls. So all right. So this is factory. So. It's, controls are pretty simple, so I'm pretty sure I can fix the audio in a second. Okay, it's actually not that bad. Alright, so um, all you gotta do is so W makes you go forward, A makes you go to the left, S makes you go backwards, and D makes you go to the right, of course. And then uh, Q will make you go down. E will make you go up. Uh, so if you're in first person, if you hit R, it'll make you uh, release from the person. Same thing if you're uh, in first person. If you hit Q, you'll go into third person. And uh, so to get into third for into third for into third person or first person, whatever you want to lock onto a character. All you have to do is you have to hit uh, 1, 2, 3, or 4, or 5, or whatever they are. You can see it at the top right. You can see the different players. 
you can see uh, like Gruff. So I would hit number one for Gruff. And then for the red team, I would hit the F keys. So you see um, roll, Rod is back. I would hit F3 and it would go and it would spectate Rod is back. And then just release it by hitting R. And then uh, if you want to make you, if you want to go faster, you hit shift. And uh, if you want to lock onto a person, you just left click. And then if you want to release from that person, you just right click. And I'm pretty sure that is... Okay, yeah, you can also hit H. H will hide your HUD. Which uh, makes it a little bit more cinematic. You can't hide the name tags as far as I know, or yet, at least. And I'm pretty sure that is it for the controls. If you hit escape, you can bring up the menu to leave. That's all the controls. Moving on. Um, so now you know how to install the game. You know how to put it into spectator mode. But there's a lot of mod maps as you can see now. And to open up the mod maps, what you do is you go to contractors mods which is also a dot io so contractors dot mod dot io and it'll pull up the contractors uh mod page with all the different uh mods so these are all the mod maps and uh different pages of them all you got to do you hit login uh, you log in with your Steam, whatever you put as your Steam, you log it in. I'm not going to do that right now, <laughs> but you just log in and, uh, and then you can just go up, you can go up to me up here on this eyeball. You just hit subscribe. I recommend just hitting subscribe on all the maps for now, uh, or just the ones that you need at the moment. And then, uh, you can get back to the maps later. So you just you just hit uh, subscribe and then you'll be able to spectate in the mod map. Otherwise, you won't be able to spectate in the mod map and you'll you'll just be sent back to the home page. And again, if there's any issues or anything that you have concerns about, message me on Discord at Verum V E R U M and then pound or the hashtag um, four seven four five. DM me on there, or you'll see me on the Contractors Discord, or my own Discord, or whatever else, under, probably under the name Lord, or Virum, same thing, same person, same account, actually, and uh, I'll see you guys around, hope this helped out.